Earlier this week, we told you that Virginia Tech researchers found the virus that causes COVID-19 in our backyard wildlife. Possums, deer mice, and another handful of creatures tested positive for SARS-CoV-2. Now, Carla Finkelstein is a professor at Virginia Tech and director of the Molecular Diagnostics Lab at Tech's Fralin Biomedical Research Institute. She says the question they were trying to answer with their recent study was how are these animals getting infected in the first place? Well, they found that the more humans are in an area, the more animals they're finding with SARS. Finkelstein says it's likely animals are infected through wastewater, trash, and discarded food left by humans. Of course, we need to be really mindful on the way that we interact with wildlife. And I think that is one of the things that we want to bring to everybody's attention. I think the way that we approach all these problems is a multidimensional in the sense that um, we need to continue surveillance of the virus and the wildlife to see where it's going. We need to educate people on how to interact with wildlife. Um, I think we need to educate ourselves on how we dispose of our trash and everything to prevent wildlife from being infected. Well, Finkelstein emphasized that there's no evidence the virus can spread from our backyard critters to people. But she says that's why they need to keep an eye on the issue. In the case that the virus mutates so it can spread, we can be prepared to fight any new strain.